This is Think Like a Master Electrician. If you like this sort of content, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you have your own NEC questions you'd like to see answered, be sure to leave them in the comment below, and I'll try to make a video answering them. Let's get into it. A 208 volt, three phase, 50 horsepower, squirrel cage, continuous duty, design C, AC motor, has a full load running current of blank amperes. So there's a lot with this motor. We know it's 208 volt, we know it's three phase, we know it's horsepower, we know it's a squirrel cage, we know it's continuous duty, we know it's a design C motor. That's a lot. But the main question is all it's really asking for is the last part. It has a full load running current of what? So that is what we're gonna be looking for. We're going to go to our index for this one to kind of show you how I would find this. Index is in the back of the book. We're going to look up M. Uh, LMN OP so G H I L M motors. So we're going to look for full load current. Now you see how there's an indention? All of these are subsections of conductors. So be careful when you're looking through your index. And we're going to keep looking here. Full load current. Now it says the full load current motors. So I'm going to go do full load current. So we're going to go to F's now. F. We're in F. And we're going to go to full, where's full, uh -huh. full load current motors, alternating current, we know we have a three phase, this is going to be article 430, 250, so let's go look for 430, 430, 250. Now we just need to find the motor. 208, three phase, uh, three phase 50 horsepower. 208. Uh, this is for three phase motors. And we're going to go to 50 horsepower, which gets us 143. That's your answer.